I am Yufum and this is a video. God. <laughs> I'm already recording, so that was beautiful. Y you can do the intro for us. Awesome. Anyway, hi, what's up? Uh, yo, uh, I'm Fum. You know me! Uh, that's amazing. I know, right? Dude. <laughs> are, you, are, you, you're, are you gonna plug my channel, like, right now? I guess. Okay. Yeah, go subscribe to this idiot. That's all. Yes, so! Uh, yes. A, a little while ago, I uploaded, like, me trying to spam. It went horribly, and you thought it was like, yeah, I can teach you. And I was like, sure, go ahead. I I'll need it. So, uh, from what I understand, you have like a few levels for me that you want me to try out, and you're gonna teach me like technique. More than levels, I wanna first like, okay, look, th this is like actual class stuff. Get your notebook. I'm joking. I, I was about uh, to pull up Notepad, bro. What I mainly want you to try right now is like make like sort of like a diagnosis kind of how well you can like do stuff with you know, your two hands to like also to like teach you what to do and how to do things. Okay. And then we can start more working on more specific stuff. That sounds fun. That like, sounds exciting. I absolutely no clue uh, how this is gonna end up going. Uh. I have no coordination when it comes to my hands, so hopefully I don't fail too bad. The first thing I want you to try is to just play a regular level in a level by Rob Top with your left hand. Okay, because... I can do that. with spacebar yeah. or with uh, like anything? Uh, with whatever like you feel comfortable. Like you normally use your mouse for right hand clicking. So if you want to like, learn to like use I don't know left hand on spacebar, right hand on mouse, you can. You can okay. uh, use your yeah use your space bar. So I I wanted to do blast processing because blast processing is bomb. It's the funny level. It's the wave level also. Yeah. How comfortable does your left hand? Considering I've beaten a few levels left handed before, just as a meme, it's like somewhat comfortable. I'm like not ambidextrous, but I have like good utility with my left hand in general. So it's not like horrible, but it's definitely like slightly worse than normal. If that makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. like it's kind of understandable. If you're worse with your left hand, it would be weird if you'd be better with your left hand, honestly. I mean, my my wave spam is kind of fire. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty good. Can, I, can, can, I, can oh, I do Blast oh, Processing, you didn't, you didn't grab the coin, you, you are bad. I'm game. sorry! I'll get it next time. Don't die to the end of Blast Processing. This is the hard part of the level, honestly. I always found the end of Blast Processing to be so much harder. Since you're one attempting Blast Processing, I think you are... Pretty much like ready to start learning how to use both of your hands to spam. Let's go. First ever completion. Pog! I, I, I beat video. it. I, I did it one attempt. I'm so good. Amazing. Uh, yeah, real gamer. Uh, wait, I have like 20 tabs open. Let me clean up my desk. <laughs> you made me try to not destroy your computer. Uh, true. I recorded something here. Yo. Uh, Speaking of computers, by the way, link in the description. First of all, I want to know, like, what do you want to learn, like, spamming? Do you want to learn, like, how to click fast, like, do a straight wave, do, I don't know, UFO For me, spam? it's consistency. Because I'm able to spam, like, kind of fast. I've spammed much faster than I thought I did. Uh, I was doing the whole, like, clicks per second thing with Mega Heck Music, and I got up to, like, 10. So I'm not, like, horrible. But I'm horrible at keeping it consistent. Like, I, I can't keep, like, a straight line. I can't, like, maintain a rhythm. That's, like, the one thing I yeah. want to get good at. I want to be able to maintain a rhythm so I can do stuff like WOW in the future. Yeah, so your concern isn't, like, necessarily how to, like, straight wave perfectly. It's, like, clicking uh, in a straight pattern. Like, yeah, the, yeah, yeah, yeah. There are quite a few things I can do for that. Like this video mainly focuses on how or what I do with my hands while I do like straight waving stuff. This is more related to click releasing, which won't be as important for you right now if you want to learn mm -hmm. just how to click. Uh, for things like uh, click consistency, I would suggest like, although the spam you, you want, basically if you want to spam consistently, first you need to know how fast. I, I, I think Spider is a good game mode for that because you can you only focus on clicking and you can like put obstacles in between here. So that way you can focus on consistent clicking. Like this is a, like a really easy example, like doing something like this. Uh, if you want to like try consistent clicking, like you can do this with Spyron and you can make like a big long level like this. Mm -hmm. Like this, uh, doing like this with one hand is probably really easy, but 
you will have to learn how to use two, two of your hands to do this, so... I mean, I could probably whip that together myself in, like, a second, or ten. You, you can ju just do something simple like this, then we can go to, like, I don't know, faster speeds. Okay, so you said to practice it with uh, doing both hands, right? Yeah, yeah, you can first try doing it with left hand, like, only left hand, just to, like, get used to the speed. A little bit faster. Ah, I did it. Nice. I'm so good. And then I can just like start alternating, right? Yeah. Like when you start alternating, it might be a bit difficult. It's mostly practice. Is it do you do you think it's best to like alternate both spacebar or do you think it's better to do spacebar up arrow spacebar up arrow? Which one do you uh, think is better? Uh depends on what you're comfortable with really. If okay. you like like playing with a mouse and right hand and not moving your hand from your right mouse, you can literally just like uh I don't know, put your left hand anywhere else. And start clicking like that with your hand on your mouse and your left hand on space or up arrow. I personally like switching both of my hands to spacebar because I get a better feel for when I'm spamming. Yeah, that makes sense. So, I don't know uh, how hard this is for you right now. Like, it, it is pretty difficult to, like, alternate hands when playing and, like, trying to get a rhythm. It's surprisingly it's hard of, like, because I, I've mentioned yeah. this a lot in previous videos and I do mention it a lot. I, I'm very bad with rhythm in, in general, that's why I don't use like audio cues when playing. But I feel like the, this kind of exercise is probably going to help me get a lot better with time. Uh, yeah, uh, no, I don't know like uh, how, like right now you might find it a little bit difficult if you get, if you like played for a few more minutes, you'll probably get the hang of it a lot more. Yeah, probably. But uh, yeah, the thing like you want to focus right now is like get a feel <sighs> on how you have to click with spacebar. Be consistent now. No! Motherfucker. Is, is the last fight just harder? I'm a stupid. I'm I'm stu I'm just stupid. By the way, I'm also gonna be experimenting a little bit by trying my Oh, I did it. Bar. Nice! I'm so proud of myself. Now, try speeding it up a little bit. Like, you used to X speed and uh, try to do the same thing. The rhythm is way faster and you'll feel it quite noticeably. Like, changing rhythm when spamming, you will see it's, it's quite difficult actually. Yeah, I I can already tell. Yeah, you have to get used to a speed very well before you... Uh, you have to get used to the spam speed quite a lot because you need to coordinate both of your hands and if you're slightly off with one hand, then you basically mess up the entire pattern. Yeah, I can tell. If you get really good at like two-hand method... Uh, if you get really good at two-hand method, you can basically use your left hand as the same as you would with your right hand. Mm. And that helps a lot when doing click patterns that are very fast and very weird because you can just use your left hand like to do a one click and you can rest your right hand quite a lot like yeah I, i've noticed whatever. guitar style does that a lot where he just like switches to left hand when whenever he gets like tired especially in like longer levels that just require a lot of clicking he, he did that a lot in freedom away especially i can show you like somewhere where like i particularly like using uh, my left hand to click and it helps him quite a lot like just to show you an example of what normal people do and what i do and why we have a big advantage over people this way right here I don't know if you're looking at this. Uh, I am That's, looking now on screen. Uh, I'm gonna speed hack. Uh, this wave right here, uh, this part right here is, as you can see, it's two really weird and tight uh, wave clicks, as you can see, it's like super precise. Yeah. And what normal people, what they do is they try to do that, which is basically like near frame perfect timing and everything. Mm -hmm. But what I do here is I do this and then do a click with my left hand right here. Yeah, so you like... And you, you can see the click pattern it looks completely awful, but it, it is so, so much better to play. So if I do speed hack, it's, it is so consi it's super consistent. Well, I practice this a lot, but... Yeah, uh, but I, it, 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 I feel like the thing is, is that it just you use the utility that you get with your left hand to make something that's normally like really inconsistent slightly more consistent, right? Yeah, go back to the spider level. Yeah, I did it. Practice. Nice. Hog of champ. I just had to find the like the beat that I had to do it in. As soon as I found yeah. how to, like the speed that I had to go in, it made it way easier. Because right now, like you the clicks get quite a lot faster and you have to rely more on your own rhythm to do it rather than timing each single click lol <laughs> i did just it. do it yeah 
Uh, you, okay, that, that's pretty insane. I gotta do that again though, that was definitely a fluke. Like, you are getting, like, really good at spamming, like, really fast. Isn't that a good thing though? Yeah, it's really good. Go away on, go, go! Let's Did it! Yeah! Now, for XP, the, the final boss of the final spy Final gauntlet. Run. Quad speed, yeah. 4 XP. What TPS is this? Is it like nearly 10 TPS? So this is above what your CPS limit is. So this one will be interesting. Yo, let's go. Ha! Such a gamer. I feel like, so, it, to me, I, it's just I, finding out like the speed. I'm good at maintaining speed when I click. One of the things that I'm really good at is just keeping a consistent speed once I've actually find like a good click speed. The hard part for me is just finding that said click speed. It's like, um, mainly timing, so yeah. The if you get the correct click speed and you memorize it correctly, you can pretty much do this like every single attempt. If you have very good like muscle memory for speed and that stuff. Doing uh, uh, click, th th this, doing this with wave by the way might be a little bit overkill for what you want because with this you'll have to train your, um, release uh, and training your releases is a way harder than training your click speed yeah like you can is, give it that, a shot if you want like at slow speeds i don't know how hard it will be like i personally find it very very hard to do click patterns at very slow speeds because i have like i got used to spamming fast getting the feel for how you click like with your left and right hand is probably the most important thing because you cannot like at really high speeds you cannot think like uh, oh i have to like click and release for like this much you just kind of feel it out since there are like more than 10 clicks in each second and you can focus on any single one of those clicks I it doesn't have to speed. be too fast like it can be something like this but make sure you are happy with your click speed and then you can work towards like faster click speed uh, also as you can see my releases sometimes are not perfect but i kind of like correct my own path sometimes yeah but yeah uh you can get used to a certain click speed and then try doing it faster or doing it slower. Mm -hmm. And yeah, after that makes you sense. practice a lot of speeds, you can start changing like between those speeds and then you'll like be able to control very well how you want to spam whenever. It's all about learning certain click speeds, how you how it feels to do them, to do the speeds and all of that. I think for me personally, as a person who just never plays just spacebar, I think it's better for me to try and practice that. I can't always just Do that right i feel like that's just reasonable with wave it's much easier than something like um Ooh, nice that was really good yeah because i i have a good feel for like when i release like how long i release or how long i tap for i feel like it's better for me to try and practice with um mouse and keyboard at the same time because most likely i'll just be like alternating taps with spacebar maybe for wow i might end up going like Spacebar uh, and just just spacebar. We'll, we'll see what happens, right? We'll see what happens. I, we'll take it when that happens. That looks so bad. Okay, I, 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 I don't know. Let's just give you homework uh, really quick. Oh, oh my god, I'm back. That was uh, hard. It is hard. I, I feel like that's the uh, whole purpose. It's supposed to be hard. Uh, I, I'm not good at spamming today. The best part about this is that it's gonna make me making awesome clickable thumbnails on YouTube amazing. This is just clickbait okay. simulator, basically. That's what this is. But thank That's you, I really appreciate it. I'm gonna practice, and I'm gonna see how it, everything goes, and I'm hopefully not gonna break my fingers. Everyone go check out UFWM. He is a very gamer. He is very talented at ge the geometry dashes. So, yeah. Uh, check out his channel. Link to that is in the description as per usual. And, yeah. Uh, hopefully I'll be able to do this sometime. That'll be cool.